after handing out the cards, Reginald Sneasel is uh look at is, has not read his card yet, but he's thinking ahead and being happy and he's thinking ahead wishfully and happily. Oh what fun! That le that cute little Fluffy will have my screen name, Sneasel Fox, and I'll have hers. Bunch of bunch thirty five. What? Then with his keen eye, he looks over at Layla, over at Layla's card and reads, "Fluffy Lab 237, Menchwood, Punch a Bunch 35." Reginald Sneasel, Sneasel Fox, Menchwood, Florida 217. <gasps> and he knocks his barb, he knocks his barber doll over. No. But then Punchy reads his card. And he's like, "Hmm, yeah, okay, Fluffy Lab 237." Whatever. I have my eyes on Angie Rosa nine thirty-eight. <laughs> yes. Wild Sonic, you, aka Spider Shock thirty-eight. Match with did Doug get four sixteen? Uh, Ivy does not look at hers because she, she's gonna look at. She's not. She's not. She's gonna hold out for me. For me, yeah. Then Simone uh, Rose, you, aka did Doug get four sixteen? Get match with Spider Shock thirty-eight. Uh yeah, here's Floridora two seventeen who got spot who got matched up with Sneasel Fox. And this guy, George Phillip, is uh paired up with uh Ivy, but he can't he doesn't know it really because he got smudged. The name got smudged. <laughs> Shortly later, we see Punchy Sancho in front of a quick cola machine. Hmm. The current the currency in Quickville is comprised of W and C quarters, which is similar to rings to Sonic. W is equal ten and C equal one, so it's like he takes ten C's to make a W. But anyway, all Punchy has is W's, and the machine only accepts C's. Anyway, hmm. Wild come Wild walks in and say, "Hey, Punchy, why the face? Uh, I want a soda." But it takes only C quarters. I only have W quarters. Do you have any change? Uh, sh uh, let me let me check. Uh, oh, you're in luck. I have 12 C quarters. I'll give you 10 for a W. Cool. Thanks. So the bunchy gives Wild his W quarter. He gets 10 C quarters. He grabs a quick cola and enjoys it. Meanwhile, there's a sleuthing Reginald Sneasel hiding, hiding around the corner. Huh. I should have been the one paired up with that cute fluffy Layla. You shall not win her heart, you red dude. I will see to it myself. That's the next class day, April eighth, Tuesday, in the computer lab. Well, welcome to the I Date Lab. To ensure a nominee in your partners, all gentlemen will work on one side of the lab, facing away from the women on the other side of the lab. Okay, log in and meet your faceless partners. So now we converse between, right now we're conversing between Wild and Simona. Also known as Pirash, between Spire Shock and Dig Dugget. So as Wild says, hello. She said, hello. Hmm. It's a nice day, isn't it? Uh, yeah. It is. How do you like the class? Oh, it's cool. Ever thought, ever though, even though I am usually wild, I feel shy around women. You? Oh, same here. I get goose pimply around guys a bit. Ah, uh, no worries. I promise not to bite. <laughs> Do you like me so far? I'm enjoying our chat so far. You're doing okay. Then we go. Then we go to the chat between Punchy and Layla. Okay. Hey, what's up? Hello. Um, I'm feeling bashful. Oh. It's cool. I would I would be shy myself if I had not set my eyes on my go. Oh? How do you know you still want her at the end of the semester? Hmm. I think I stand a good chances. She's a good girl. Really? Won't you even give me a try before you go bye bye? Ooh. Are you jealous? <laughs> but then Reginald talks Reginald's sitting right next to Punchy. He said, Hey, I hear partner had a daddy Taurus and loathes the color red. And 
She likes women. Don't mess with me, dude. I'm on a roll here with this girl. Punchy thanks in response. But anyway, fortunately, but anyway, between Punchy and Simona, compliment they compliment each other. They found lots in common. Few opposites. Flirt, flirt, flirt. They got each other excited, ignited rarest inspirations, and enjoying and loving every moment. Between Punchy and Layla, Layla talks and gains Punchy's interest. They found lots in common, and she really turns on the charm. <laughs> uh, Punchy starts to fall for Layla over Angelica. Also, Punchy checks the rumors from Reginald with Layla, most of which were verified false. And being a sad little sap Reginald is, he adores Floridora. She, he feels jealousy, sadness, and loneliness, and contributed little. And Flores feels dumped and lonely, and yet she tries and tries to cheer Reginald up. Poor little girl. Poor girl. I feel like I'm getting the raw end of the deal here. What the? Later on, after that class day, Wild late Wild leaves the uh, school. He says, he's thinking, Wow, Dick Dudet, Dick Duggett is a fun treat. I wish I knew which girl she was. A one out of seven chance. Oh, I hear you, Layla girl. Spidey was fun for me, and he was a real gentleman to talk to. Spidey. <laughs> Sounds like it might he not find out who she is after all. Yes, Simona is talking to uh, Layla, and Zapina comes in to interrupt the chat. Oh, hey, Zapina. I was just chatting with my new life gal pal, Layla. Hi. Hey, Layla. Hello, Mama. Waffy, <laughs> you're one to talk. You have your arm drills. You need to pump to fully dig the dug. <laughs> oh, then Wild and Punchy are definitely noticing the conversation going on between the ladies. That's class date, April 10th on a Thursday. Punchy says, I think I know who you are. <laughs> I overheard an, real, an, R, an IRL chat between you and a friend. Oh, you naughty boy. We're not supposed to have gone real life yet. Oh, I know. Hmm. Well, what you have in mind? You have moved me better than Angie. How about dinner and a movie after class? Well, but Reginald sneaks under and is prepared to snip the cord of connection. <laughs> he disconnects Punchy's keyboard. I'd love to, but let's only have dinner tonight. And I'm in the mood for grilled ch for grilled chicken sandwich at MCD. Is that cool? Uh, yeah. Well, wait a minute. I'm not getting anything in. What the? I can't type anything in. Bunch, bunch of bunch. Wild, wild. He's sitting wild, sitting right next to him. So he tells Wild, please go tell the fluffy girl I said it is cool. I'm here outside the school, and my keyboard stopped working for me. Dang it! What the deuce? So then, yet against the uh, teacher's instructions, Wild goes to the women's side and talks to Layla and talks to talks to Laugh at Layla. Uh, excuse me. Yes. Uh, Punchy. Uh, Punch a bunch. Sent me to inform you his keyboard stopped working, but he will meet you outside the school building there. Oh dear. Well, please tell him it is good. I'll meet him at the front school school front about 4:30. Thank you. Hmm. And then, and then Wild looks over at her screen, and he sees that uh, it's the same conversations he's been having with uh, Dig Dug in. <gasps> I thought so. He exclaims, and then he says, "What?" And then he points over to Simona. He says, "I've been talking to her this whole time." And Simona notices and surprise, and turns around and sees him. <gasps> oh my God! Spider shock. Yeah. Wow, you're more handsome than you give yourself credit for. And you are simply dazzling. Cupid's arrow has struck.